10290 West 14th Place. Just got done cleaning the sewer line from two-way outside access, and now we're scoping the sewer line. Uh, we're 44 foot back underneath the house, and this is where the downstairs toilet ties in. You can also see where the upstairs toilet comes in here. So everything just kind of comes together here at 44 feet. We'll just pull back slowly here and do our inspection. So pipe underneath the house is original cast iron. the toilet a few times also had the kitchen sink running the whole time I was cleaning the line all right so cast iron comes out of the house there and turns to clay cast iron underneath the house is in good shape Piping. This is original clay tile sewer. And there was some tree roots in here upon cleaning it. Looks like we've removed those. our connection onto the ABS piping that's at our outside cleanouts. A little bit of an offset there, but it's the right direction. It's on the bottom. Not going to affect the flow of the sewer line. And then we'll just go down the other cleanout here and look towards the street. Like from the clean outs, it's about a 15 foot piece of plastic piping in there to 14.7 foot there it turns to clay. back onto some plastic there 27 foot is clay to PVC connection again a bit of an offset at that connection but it is on the bottom of the pipe and then right back onto clay there so that was most likely a city repair there anytime they just do a couple of feet like that in the street it's usually a city repair or a boring company that nicked it and had to fix it. Flip our camera here. There we go. There's our city sewer there at 50 foot. That's our tap connection into the city. A little bit of an offset there.
zero two nine zero west 14th place sewer line has been cleaned tested and inspected and is flowing well at this time sewer line does have few very slight offsets in the sewer line and then also a very slight flat section in the pv or in the pvc piping that's in the street recommendation is to clean the line annually to maintain the tree roof